Yo, it's Tang, and welcome back. Let's clock in. So the whole point of the story is we're looking for our treasure. Okay, the cannon right here. The dark cavern was no match for you, eh? Long neck silver to the rescue. Treasure sure to be ours, Captain. Bring the amulet over here so I can see. Chloe is so <sighs> excited. I better bring her the amulet before she makes me walk the plank. Tire garden. It's probably the garden they grew right here. This was a fun experiment. I'm almost surprised we actually managed to grow something. Okay, so we got a table. Let's head over to her. What is that thing? A kite. <laughs> Are you ever gonna get your kite down from the roof? It was unhappy in captivity. I set it free. You must be a hero to kites everywhere. What is this? Chloe's bottle rocket. <laughs> the fastest way to get an entire bottle of soda <laughs> in your hair. <laughs> Ugh, sticky. All right. Let's take a photo. Hey, Chloe. Yar. Walk the plank. Land all. Zoo land land all. Land ho. Oh, land ho. Perfect. All these memories. Wait just a minute. Yar. You must permission before setting foot or peg on another captain's boat permission to come aboard permission to come aboard captain bluebeard Grrr. one amulet coming right up okay uh i, th I think it goes uh, damn it i forget how to make this Stay on. Stay here. I'll find something to hold it on. Thanks. Find something. So. Time to stick the amulet to the telescope. Then that treasure is. Well, obviously. That didn't. Work around here as a cannon. Throw drawing table. Leaf pile. Is there something? Grill, skateboard, painter's tape. Exactly. Score. One step closer to getting that treasure. Whatever it is. Yo, I might as well just take a look at this leaf here. I wish this was big enough to jump in. It's only September. It'll be totally dive bombable in a few weeks. Yeah. A few when weeks. I'm not here. Painter's tape or pirate's tape? Pirate's tape. Ahoy, Bluebeard. I have brought the stickiest tape in all the seven seas. Well done, fellow scallywag. Just like old times. Huh, Max? Remember how we used to talk about ruling the bays of Arcadia one day? We thought we were going to be pirates forever. We are still pirates. If being a pirate means acting silly and going on crazy adventures together, then we'll always be pirates. Hell yeah. <sighs> Would you like to do the honors, Long Max Silver? Me? Are you sure? Of course. Come on, navigator. Point me to some treasure. Point you on some treasure. Wait. How am I supposed to use this? The drawing on the lens. It should line up with something. Here goes. Drawing on the lens. Okay. 
This drawing is supposed to line up with something. Of course, I do all the hard. So I, I'm pretty sure it, it most likely goes this this way, right? So it lines up right here. Got it. <laughs> yes, you rock. Where is it? Here? Uh, to the right. Okay, take a step right. Oh, I'll stop. No, no. The other right. My other right or your other right? Mine. My other right. Got it. Wait, what? <laughs> Just go that way. Perfect. Now come towards me. Right there. There we got it. Bingo. That was an easy lineup. I kind of, I kind of figure like it's upside down. What, what can we possibly be digging down here? Like, what did we do? Do you remember? I don't know what we what you guys buried. What is this? I I don't know. Let's open it. From Bloody Bill. From Bloody Bill. Who's that? I'll get the tape layer. Aha. <laughs> Chloe's dad is such a goofball. <laughs> Ahoy there, plank walkers. <laughs> it's me, Buddy Bill, <laughs> the Pirate King. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> By now, you'll have seen that I dug up your treasure, which would normally make us mortal enemies. But hear me out. I haven't pilfered a thing. On the contrary, I figured you swashbucklers might not be back to your loot for some time, so I've given it extra protection from the winds and rain. I'm sure you're excited to open your time capsule, so I won't go on too long. Just know that Bloody Bill bloody proud of you both of you <laughs> keep those sails trimmed and that anchor scrubbed and always remember the real treasure is friendship love your Oregon State prepaid college savings plan prepaid <laughs> uh. That's what we originally buried. Huh, yeah. I guess it probably would have gotten ruined underground. What is it? Let's see. Holy crap! It's Billy the Squid! He's alive! Oh, man! It really is like a time capsule. No way! Chloe, look at this. We wrote each other letters. <laughs> oh, I remember these. Chloe Price. Thanks, Max. <laughs> I hope you are having a lot of fun being a teenager with your best friend. Aw. You are so cute. <sighs> Check it out. Ugh. Maxine? Maxine. Dear Chloe, how are you today? I am doing very well. It is Friday, June 27, 2003. It is summer vacation. We are making a time castle for you and me in the future we are making it pirate theme wasn't it hilarious to find these are some things we like favorite animal arabin horse max otters chloe favorite food lobster roll max coffee ice cream chloe favorite class in school arts of library science for chloe best friend each other both how about you are you 
age 12 or more what are your favorite food movie etc that's all for now i hope you're having a lot of fun being a teenager with your best friend sincerely maxine caulfield all right <laughs> how about mine what did i write this is so chloe let's see here dear maxine hello from 2003 here is a record of how we spent our days can you guess which one is real? We go to the same school and always sit together on lunch. At lunch, duh. We have sleepover at least once a week. We like extremely salty pretzels. We are in a race to see who can convince your parents to get a pet first. We're going to live to we're going to live together when we can't afford it and use only gold paint. We have battled many foes and never fail to save each other. What did you guess? If you guess all of them, you're right. Your friends forever, Chloe Elizabeth Price. You were really funny. You are really sweet. Let's go with that. You were really sweet. Oh man, I was really goopy. I like it. That's because you're a goop. This is so cool. There's so much to look at. Is your mom going to mind about this mess? Dunno. I thought they'd be home by now. Max, remember scratch art? Oh, I love this stuff. I'm gonna draw something. All these memories. I want to look at everything. This one here to say that this should be home by now. Is this taking place in between where the dad was going to pick up the mom at a grocery store and then against an accident. Is this where this happens right now? Let's uh, look at everything. It actually might be really fun to write letters to Chloe after I move. Read that. Let's get the Billy, Billy the Squid. It's good to see you, old friend. A time capsule. Prediction. <laughs> Such a good idea. Far off base. Let's see prediction. So prediction for the future by Chloe and Max. We will still hang out together. It's better to hang out with each other more than instead. with any other person. False. Both of us are medium popular. Eh. Both of us are dating our second boyfriend. Eh. We do not make decisions without consulting each other. The consulting each other. The talking skull of our enemies. Both of us have pets. Chloe has visit Antarctica. Max could have come if she wanted one of us has a little sister or brother we're doing it well we're doing well in school these are awesome chloe's always been good at making up cool things to do flint steel ray kind of like a ray ray gun uh god holy crap it's the end of that comic in chloe's room Oh, this is gross. Maybe you should have come down in power of flight this dude face with face off with me. This container looks like it could last a hundred years. Manga might be the one thing where Chloe out nerds me. We always make so much more of a mess here than at my house. I love how Polaroid cameras make every photo look a little nostalgic. Me and Daddy. Hey, got photos here. Chloe and I have been friends for so What's long. What's that? Chocolate chip cookies in the back? Maybe I'm worrying too much about this move changing. Things. Halloween 2001. Halloween 2002. I guess I should try talking to Chloe again about my news. I'm. You're I can such do that space after space. I finish looking Move at over. everything. Nope. Chloe, I gotta tell you something. I'm moving out of here. Okay, bub. I'm getting out of here. Hey, hippie. Uh, how's the masterpiece? Working on the last bit. How about you? Done with the time capsule? 
Yep. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Well, perfect, because now I'm finished. Check it out. <laughs> Max heck? first tattoo. <laughs> uh. What tattoo am I getting? A heart with my initials? Duh. Oh, Chloe, you were really drawing me that whole time. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mushiness alert. <laughs> Keep it together, Max. I guess now's my Say chance it. to tell Chloe. Say it. We might not be alone again once our parents get Say it. Hey, ready for something else? I've got a great plan for the afternoon. Um. Crap. I don't want to ruin the rest of the day. You're staying for dinner, right? Because this idea will be perfect at sunset. Me to tell her? You... She didn't seem to want to talk about anything serious. You're about upstairs. to be pissed off. She's about to be pissed off. Well, regardless, she's going to be pissed Max? off. Max? It's just Seattle. I'm probably overstressing about the whole thing. Right? Tell her. We're telling her. Chloe? Max? I want to tell you something. Okay. This is the big decision, I, isn't it? Um, <laughs> my family's moving to Seattle. Really soon. Hey. In three days, right? What? You knew that? Our parents do talk, you know? But they said I should be the one to tell you. They still told my parents. I guess mom and dad were trying to keep quiet too, but they're bad at hiding anything. The whole time she knew. Don't look so worried, Max. It's okay. Come on, Dorkmeister. It's not the end of the world. Why did you pretend? I should have told you earlier. Let's see, why did you pretend? Why did you pretend like you didn't know? I don't know. I, I guess... I guess I didn't want it to be true. Like... Why ruin the little time we have left? I was thinking that too. Plus, I know you hate this kind of conversation, so I just left it alone, you know? Come on. I want to spend every minute we have together having fun. We'll keep in touch and visit. I'm worried I won't be okay. Uh, well, we didn't keep in touch. Let's just go with I'm so worried that I won't be okay without you. Hey, stop that. Of course you'll be okay. We're Max and Chloe, remember? We're always together. Even when we're not. That's true. Cool. Let's find something fun to do. <gasps> oh shoot, this is the news. This is the news. Mom? Man, this is like... Now the whole perspective of everything. Her friends moving. In a few days, her dad died. I was right. So this was in between where the dad went to pick up the mother. The grocery store got into that.
and then the then everybody lives just change from that point. Went from being good at school to not being good at school. Arcadia Bay Cemetery. Cemetery. Oh man. Nineteen seventy two thousand eight. So he was thirty eight years old. Nineteen Looking back, oh, the move, the move, moving to Seattle. The house just like the whole just the whole mood just changed everything. Think about that happen, man. That's crazy. That's just friend move, your dad passed away. I mean that's just all like at once. I kind of see why her, why she is the way how she is like rebellious and all that. I'm sorry. This is Chloe's recording. Hey Chloe, this is Max. I guess I just wanted to leave you one more message. Because I know this was the absolute worst time for me to go. I thought maybe if you hear my voice, it could be a little bit like I was there. I don't know. Maybe this was a dumb idea. I would give anything to be there with you. It's so hard trying to say what I'm thinking if I could just see you. But we'll get it. We'll get at it. Great at it. We'll write and talk all the time. Yeah, that did not happen. And then you come visit and it's like, it'd be like, I never left. I mean, you, you don't have to worry about anything, about anything changing. Oh, a lot of things change. You're dealing with so much more other stuff. You don't deserve any of this. Chloe, listen, if I, if I never even... If we were moving for a good, we're always together, okay? Even when we're, we're apart. We're still Max and Chloe. I will always, always love you. Goodbye. It's supposed to be some music going on right now playing, but obviously due to copyright, I had to mute all that, all that up. Life is strange before the storm. Mm, that is pretty much that is officially the end of the first life is strange and we honestly so we get to see the chloe side no we get to see max side of the story we get to see chloe 
before in the in the between between that gap where Max left and uh, Chloe and Rachel, we see that. Now we see the 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 the, the, the earlier friendship right before Max leaves. We did that, and uh, as I watched this, life is strange. Was it double exposure coming out? Based practically the sequel to this is coming out. Gonna go ahead and play that one. And uh, so far, I played True True Colors. And obviously, this Life is Strange. I I do want to play Life is Strange too. Now I know Life is Strange too is completely separate from this. Um. That's that's on my list to you know play. You guys, hope you guys enjoyed the series here. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.